Hey there, viewers! Several cultures around the world stress on the healing power of herbs and spices. But is there any science behind why they're good for you? Turns out, yeah, there is. In today's video, we're going to talk about nine of the world's healthiest spices and herbs you should be eating. Can a sprinkle of cinnamon in your morning coffee really boost your health? Is a turmeric latte as healthy as people make it out to be? What about ginger and cayenne pepper? Is peppermint really good for your mood? We'll be discussing all of these and more. Number 1. Turmeric Turmeric provides a lot of health benefits. This spice has the antioxidant curcumin in high quantities. Curcumin is capable of treating a wide variety of health-related issues. Its benefits include treating minor issues such as a toothache to serious conditions such as arthritis and diabetes. Curcumin is also known to help people with type 2 diabetes by ensuring cell signaling proteins, which control the blood sugar levels in your body. This particular antioxidant can also help reduce inflammation and get rid of pain. It can also help treat any metabolic illness. There have been small studies that suggest curcumin extract can also help treat depression. More research is needed to confirm whether it can help in the treatment of Alzheimer's and various forms of cancer. You can easily include turmeric in your daily diet by adding a pinch of this spice to foods you eat. Don't like the taste? Why don't you try turmeric tea or turmeric latte? You can even add a pinch of it to your morning coffee. Have you tried turmeric before? Did you like it? How did you take it? Share your experience with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number 2. Ginger Ginger is already popular for its ability to soothe upset stomachs. It can also help people suffering from morning sickness. If you feel nauseous after undergoing surgery or chemotherapy, ginger can help you deal with it. Another benefit of ginger is that it can relieve pain. In one study, their participants who took 250 milligrams of powdered ginger said they experienced relief from headaches similar to the group that took 50 milligrams of prescription meds. Additionally, the group that took ginger did not have any of the side effects the medications had. Ginger has gingerols, which are known to fight inflammation as well as certain types of cancer. These compounds can also relieve pain from osteoarthritis and reduce sore muscles. Further research has shown taking ginger extract can relieve the pain you feel in your knees when you have osteoarthritis. You can start with ginger tea first. All you need to do is boil the ginger in water, let it simmer for some time, strain it, and drink. You can also add honey and lemon juice for taste. Ginger tea tastes awesome with a gentle squeeze of lemon juice. Looking for answers on all the latest health and wellness news? Hit that subscribe button and join our millions of followers. Stay up to date on all our great bestie content. Number 3. Cayenne Pepper If you're going through a weight loss program, adding a bit of cayenne pepper to your dinner can certainly boost your efforts. This is especially effective if you don't generally eat spicy food. Cayenne pepper has a compound called capsaicin, which is responsible for the kick in spices and chilies. Research shows capsaicin can help increase your metabolic rate, which would raise the number of calories your body burns. It can also help stimulate the chemicals in your brain so that you don't feel hungry. Another advantage of cayenne pepper is its ability to make food safer. The cinnamic acid in cayenne can help destroy any of the pathogens in food, including listeria and salmonella. Cayenne also has the compound capsidiol, which is particularly helpful against the bacteria H. pylori. This is most often responsible for your stomach ulcers. Number 4. Cinnamon If you want to sweeten a dish, it would be better if you choose sweet spices such as cinnamon rather than sugar or artificial sweeteners. It's already known that eating too much sugar can lead to diabetes, but it can also cause chronic issues like heart disease. Another advantage of cinnamon is that it can help bring down your blood pressure. While reducing salt can also help with that, cinnamon is very effective. However, it doesn't mean cinnamon will work overnight. Research shows using cinnamon for at least three months gives you the best results. Cinnamon helps by opening up the blood vessels, ensuring your blood flow to the heart is smooth. This way, your heart doesn't have to work as hard to pump blood to the rest of your body. Before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Watch and learn more about the 10 body changes that need your immediate attention. Now back to our discussion on healthy spices you need to be eating. Number 5. Garlic in fiction, garlic is used to ward off vampires, but that's not all it can do. Garlic has potent bioactive compounds and various other nutrients. For instance, treatment methods that include garlic extracts, powder, or its supplements can help bring down your blood pressure. Studies have found around 550 people showed that consumption of garlic can bring down your reduced systolic blood pressure by about 8 millimeters of mercury and your diastolic blood pressure by around 5.5 millimeters of mercury. This kind of reduction is what you would get from blood pressure medication. 
Although the evidence is not strong, there are indications that garlic can even prevent colds. Number six, peppermint. Tea is generally the suggested beverage if you want to perk up your mood. What works even better is peppermint tea. The minty flavor and aroma that comes with peppermint is known to boost your mood and help sharpen your thought process. A small number of patients sniffing peppermint spirit after surgery said they felt a lot less nauseated compared to the group given a placebo or medication. It can be a good option for those who want to reduce nausea. Multiple other studies have shown that peppermint oil can help with pain management among people suffering with irritable bowel syndrome. Peppermint can help reduce the bloating in the body and relax the colon muscles. Wondering how to make peppermint tea? Boil two cups of water, add fresh mint leaves, turn off the heat and let the leaves steep for at least 15 minutes. Strain the leaves and serve the tea with a drizzle of honey and a squeeze of lemon. Number seven, oregano. You may have used oregano on your pizza toppings. What you may not know is oregano leaves are packed with antioxidants. These leaves are also high in many nutrients such as calcium, iron, and fiber. They also have vitamins K and E. Among all the other herbs, just one tablespoon of oregano has 20 times more antioxidant activity. It's also equivalent to the amount of antioxidants you get from a medium apple. When compared to blueberries, oregano has four times the antioxidants. This kind of activity is good for your heart. Antioxidants ensure there are no damage to your cells due to the free radicals in your body. As a result, they prevent diseases such as stroke, heart disease, and even cancer. Number eight, rosemary. Rosemary is part of the mint family and comes with great flavor. The scent given by rosemary is shown to improve your concentration levels. It can also help improve your mood. Additionally, rosemary has properties that can help prevent cognitive decline. In one study, it was seen that using rosemary even in small quantities can help reduce the chances of cognitive decline among the elderly. Rosemary can also help you deal with hair loss. When compared to minoxidil, which is commonly used as treatment for balding, rosemary showed similar effects of hair growth. You can switch to rosemary instead of medication if you want to avoid side effects. Number nine, black peppercorns. Peppercorns have a compound called pepperine. This is what gives them their kick. The other advantage of pepperine is that it can help reduce the risk of a few types of cancer such as lung, breast, and prostate. There are various mechanisms in pepperine that help it fight cancer. When the compound activates a special biochemical process, the cells are instructed to self-destruct before they can become a tumor. Interested in knowing more about healthy foods that you can include in your diet? Did you know there are foods that are better for women than they are for men and vice versa? Here's what you should know. Watch 11 healthy foods men should eat every day. You can also try our video on 14 healthy foods women should eat every day. Go ahead, click one, or better yet watch both and learn more about health and nutrition. Are you planning on adding any of these herbs and spices to your daily diet? Let us know in the comments below.